about a lot of stuff. All right, anyway. Yes, Wrecking Madness, all month. So basically every month they got a tournament. Okay, so these two are still here. I might redo this one too, because I hate the long hour. But, uh, Gold Rush is new as far as I know. Um, both of these feature the new car, so hmm. There, uh, yeah, okay, actually, well, I might show this show this one off too, since it's a new event type where they changed the icon for it. And maybe I can get a better score. But uh, yeah, so every month, give or take, they have a new event. And there's a bunch of new cars you can get by getting these fame points, which are separate from the in-game cash and such. Uh, but you get daily challenges and like buy daily challenges to earn those fame points. And every reward since the start of the uh, seasons is still in here. So while it may take a while to grind, the gubbins, you can get the gubbins to get the goods. Alright, well, let's just start with wrecking the titular Wrecking Madness. 61 days, so this is running for two months, it would seem. I don't believe they... Oh, this is the Wrecking Playground. Okay, this is the demo one. Alright. This isn't the holiday demo, then, because the holiday demo just had you launching Santa off of a uh, ramp into a Christmas tree. So, if they bring that back this winter, that'd be great. But, uh, all right. Uh, looks like there's a giant propeller to fall into, so that's a, that's gonna be interesting. And, okay, the Speedbird GT is the reward car for this season. It cost me, I think, it was less than 100. I don't, I think it was more than 50. It might have been 70? I want to say 70k, uh, fame. So. Yeah, with these events, uh, like, it's gonna hold on to your score to the, till it wraps up, and then... Like, you gotta be good, but you can always keep, come back and keep bumping that up. And you're playing against everybody who else who's playing against it, whereas the dailies are just like a set. Score threshold or, um... What's that other, other thing? Uh, points? I don't know. Words. I, I don't have them anymore. Alright, well, let's tune this up. Oh, let's leave it medium. Let's see what happens here. Oh, I forgot to, uh forgot to adjust the audio. I'm sorry. You're not going to be able to hear anything from the game if I don't fix that first. Um, I forget if I have to go all the way up. Go 82. Good year. All right, let's try that again. The tournament should still be loaded. You it only loads once once you load the game proper, so that's why that happens. But anyway, all right, Wrecking Madness, we've got it. Now you'll be able to hear the engine. Gonna go default uh, tuning. I'm not gonna mess around with that because I'm gonna get out of the way here. Yeah, there's definitely a turbine and a loop to loop and bing bangs and. It's still kind of quiet compared to the music, but probably better that way. So let's try some of this stuff. Let's go to the, the Tilt-A-Whirl over here. Okay, so it's it's freaking... Burnout or any of these, really. Alright, tilt, tilt my whirls, baby. Boop -a -doop -a -doop -a -doop -boop 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 I'm not I'm not wrecked enough. Wreck me harder, babe. This is actually kind of... Tedious, so I guess unless you hit it at a good angle. Now is it gonna let me pick back up? Okay, good. I want to try some other toys. Let's go. I want to jump in the turbine. I you know I want to jump in the turbine. Turbine, turbine, turbine. Or no, this is more of a. This is like a dishwasher or washing machine. Welcome to the funhouse. Oofa doofa. Oh, uh, we didn't do anything cool. Let's try that a little slower. get in, but we land it. Whee! 
Alright, so that's actually kind of disappointing, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, where, okay, where's the turban? Alright, it's on the other side of the Hammer Brothers. Oh, and we got a freaking globe like the circus does with the motorcycles. And or we can jump into the... Oh my god, giant spider. It's spider day! Oh my god, it's spider day! Let's try that again. This Actually, this might have been the skin on the car for the demo. This has got the logo. The Bugbear logo. Oh, denied! It's like the windmill at the uh, freaking mini golf. But it's play today! Come at me, bro. Or don't. <laughs> What do I gotta do to get spider dead? Come on. There we go. More. Step on me. <laughs> oh, wow. I've never seen much flattening physics because usually you just get digged up from the sides and squashed into like a, ho a hoagie. My poor head is <laughs> getting shorter and shorter. Oh, you de yeah, I'm definitely bringing this back next April. You know, April 16th, Spider Day. That holiday we all celebrate. <laughs> Are you still drivable? Well, I got a little wrapped up in Spider Day. Let's try that again. For, like, an actual score. Alright. Worth it. I think we can make at least 100k easy. Is it April 16th or 17th for Spider Day? I hope I didn't get that wrong. And we'll be let back in Heavendale again. Alright, yeah, let's just, let's just like cruise towards whatever. There's probably like a most effective route, like things that beat you more. Here, let's go to Silent Charybdis here. See how this pans out. We'll just go. Wherever it respawns, we just go. Conch. Oh, we lost a wheel. That's usually super bad for acceleration. Alright, welcome to a Star War. Is that just a straight-up trash compactor? I can't turn... Yeah, I def... I def... Yeah, I definitely don't have a left front wheel. Uh, I almost want to respawn. Oh, it's like a little steamroller. Hey, let's get let, let's get a little squish. All right, that's better. Uh, I like the big north and directional signs. All right, hey, skate time to skate or die. Mostly die. Ugh. not going to be as impressive since we lost our start there. But... Oh, that's cool. Oh, 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 oh. Give me the top down. Oh, backbreaker. Beautiful. Alright, where are we going? Not there. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. That was glorious. I love that. That's good. I think ideally you can line it up and like get launched to this ramp and just do something incredibly stupid. Oh, it's just a random hammer. I thought it was like an oil uh, rig out there. Alright, we bronzed it. I'm going to get knocked out of that position sooner rather than later, but it's hammer time. What do you 
Me the squeeze. All right. Well, so what's in this warehouse? Nothing. My face. We got 30 seconds. What's this do? Oh. Oh, that's a great way to rack up score, actually. That was 16k for doing nothing. You love to see it. It's not going to get us to silver, but okay. That's a good place to grind. You just want to grind score. I want to hit one of these. Blade boys! Okay, so remember airtime is crucial, too. Okay. Well, yeah. Alright, that's cute. And w when they add the new uh, courses, you can always do a custom mode for longer time. So if you just wanted to fuck around, that'd be the place. Ugh. I like that they've got them flatter enough to the ground so that they're not going to rip your tires off. Oh, you're a little more than that. It was a bronze. Alright, so gold rush mode. That one's new to me. I don't recall ever seeing one where you chased coins. But also in these... Oh, and we're doing it here? Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. Alright. Yeah, plus uh, on P this is uh, this is actually all on every like platform by the way too, at least last gen. PS4, Xbone. I don't think it made it to the Switch. But I mean Burnout Paradise uh, remaster just got to the Switch like a within this past year, I think, so there's still a chance. Oh, and you got green dots showing you where all the coins are, so that's helpful. They look like arcade tokens. I'm gonna get some tickets. I'm gonna get a super soaker. Oh jeez. Oh, you you still you definitely have to get them all. It's timed. Okay. Well, I'm gonna botch that pretty bad. Oh, big money no whammies. I'm honestly not entirely sure if this game has. It should have me break. I think. I guess it's on A. I don't use it, so... Breaking, that's for suckers. Try too hard to be accurate here. Gotta go fast. Now, there's not that many left. Ugh. I'll resume it just to finish it, but that's not too bad. It's just a matter of getting the slide on that last bit proper. Honestly, the physics usually kick in a drift pretty well on its own. So no metal there, but I can always retry that. I never do good in the weeklies anyway. And you still get a little, you also get, yeah, regular experience towards your levels. You just don't get a uh, regular cash. So you still got to do regular races or custom races to uh, up, actually upgrade the cars. I don't know, not all the DLC cars have upgrade options, but some do. Some are usually pretty limited. All right, pretty stock race here. Gate crashers, regular car. This was the uh, new course, I believe, in the last. If it wasn't the last tournament, it was the one before that. This one's fairly recent, but I do like this course. Butterfly from hell, it's good. Ooh, forgot about this team, it's a good one. The other thing that Pop Sky does, the guy, the yeah, the person who did the song, um, Uh, they've got a lot of, um, what are they? Oh, stream alerts, too. So if you want, like, sound alerts, 
for your streams or podcasts or whatever. There's like three packs worth of them. I don't know how many is in a pack, but also pay what you want at popsky.bandcamp.com. I do not get paid to plug these. I just like having affordable things that I can play without getting in trouble. I've, I've not actually checked out the the, uh, the uh, stream alert, so I don't know what kind of drops are in there, but I might steal some. Cause I keep threatening to make a soundboard, and I have the program started with the soundboard with, like, one thing on there. I should add that Sonic Chronicles EA. Because I hate it. Uh, I'm going to do an annoying thing and pause in the middle of the race because I didn't bring chat up to the forefront here. Oop, okay. Cool, cool, cool. All right. Uh, always just you. Uh, there is an online mode um, that I have actually never played. <laughs> and the, like, the last two achievements I need are a certain amount of wins and success in online mode, if I remember correctly. And there's different race types. There are, like, more straight-up races. There's races where you're kind of encouraged to beat the crap out of people. There's races where you're encouraged to actually, you know, drive well. There are time trials. More in, um, the challenges. I don't think there's any, uh, like, time trials in the campaign mode proper. The campaign mode gives you a good tour of all the car types, though. Or, well, I should say classes. Because there's, like, European-only events. Uh, like, none of these cars are real, real, but they are, uh, most of them are based on real, you know, vehicles. Just no, 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 no existing makes or models. Legally distinct. Not quite Thunderbirds and such. And then, you, like, you get a solid spread of cars in-game, some for challenges in the story. And a, uh, the, the, the season passes are absolutely worth it. Especially if you get them on sale. But, like, even if not, you just get a whole just stack of cars. And, like, the, the DLC cars, the paid ones, are even still pretty well balanced versus everything else. So it's not like you're paying to win, which is nice. But, yeah, solo versus other cars... And these are all still bots, uh, like all the names are, lo look like the sort of names you'd find on Steam, but they're, they're, they are pull, pulled, from a pool of, uh, pulled from a pool of randomly selected ones. And the AI's got like three or four levels of difficulty, plus you can tweak damage levels, and it's very customizable to your style of play, for realism and whatnot. why we like it. I don't believe it has cross-platform on the online, but I could be incorrect. I don't know. It's been around long enough that it might have been too early for that. Alright, let's do a little Demolition Derby. Oh, and I said I would replay the, uh, the murder bug uh, stage. And then we'll move on to Sonic. The Derby will only be like three to four minutes. I forgot it's supposed to heat up here in the next few days, too. Ugh. Yeah, and, we, and we, uh, with the challenges, the dailies give you a little less fame than the bi-daily ones, and then if you actually manage to get a payout in the weekly or monthlies, that's, that's huge. You gotta get good, and I, I don't got time for that. I'm just here to dick around. I play every day, I'm just here to dick around. <laughs> Alright, uh, so we're gonna stiffen up the suspension because we're on concrete, but shorten your transmission so you accelerate more quickly and keep up your murder speed.
As you can see, I've got some armor strapped for this thing. That's optional, and you unlock some through time. More, the more armor you have, the more it slows you down. But the more hit points you have, and the more damage you do. Obviously. I'm not good at uh, reverse derbying, but okay, that didn't even count as a shunt. Let's just do my spin to win. I prefer an attack of opportunity mode. I do like having these longer cars in Derby because when they throw you that, you can sometimes get a second hit whipping your ass around. And you're not penalized for resets here. Like, see, I just smashed my ass into that guy's face. Completely consensually. They, can, they, they signed up for this, they knew what they were getting into. Sometimes when you're in midair, your hits don't register, but that one did pretty well. Right? There's a couple of these derby courses that start you off on like a nice hill and you get a good lead up on a jump and then you like just wail on somebody and you get no points because it's like but you're not touching the ground friend sorry we have no way of uh, calculating momentum from here or something this is re relatively inappropriate music for demolition derby but i'm loving it although it is called slow homicide so I should probably just reset to get out of that cluster bug. Alrighty. Alright, I'll just miss everything and ruin my front end. Also, if you get wrecked, you will get the option to respawn in the challenge derbies. In the uh, campaign, it's like, no, you gotta survive. Eleven seconds. Can I get, like, one or two more good whacks here? Fuck that guy. Managed to wreck myself out of the five-second mark. I don't even need the fame at this point, but it, I just play out of habit. <laughs> Not doing the dailies takes like 10 minutes. Maybe 15 if you got both uh, the single and the double day. Alright, yeah, I said I would replay this one because it's a fun one. Basically, it's a time to wreck every other opponent deal. You're basically in a monster truck. I'll be it in beetle form. Everyone else is pretty uh, normal. I think they're like A class, maybe B class. But it's timed. You can't tune this one. But the easiest way I found to do this. What's a little head on? I mean, really. Apply directly to the forehead. Okay, that was the cleanest first lap I've had in this in a while. I think I just cut the pack in half. And by cleanest, I mean I just murdered a bunch of people in cold blood, but. Alright, perfect would have gotten like. Just ah, oh, you little sneak. I'll be lucky to bronze this at this rate. Oh, it's only three. Payback's a bitch. Who's left? Who's left? There you go. I did better though. 
I'm going to second and change. Okay. Oh, yeah. <laughs> there we go. I feel like they've had that before, but I don't remember it having that icon. Or it just didn't show up much. Oh, yeah. That's Wreckfest. Wrecking Madness.